it's Andrea here from Crafty Little Things. Um, I'm just doing another haul video um, for you right now. Um, there's so many sales going on with the um, crafting companies at the minute, Create and Craft have all sorts of offers on, Stamping Up have got new stuff on their clearance rack, they've got a retiring this sale, um, celebrations coming up in January, there's so much going on there. Um, every Crafts a Pound have got real low price all, all the time but they've even got offers on Crafts UK I did a haul of theirs recently they're doing an advent so every day there's something today's the 20th of December so they're doing 20% off everything in your order um also um the works always have fab deals on they've got real cut prices at the moment if you want to stock up for stuff for next Christmas um then there's um who's the other one was the magazines that I hauled yesterday five magazines for fifteen quid um great way to get some freebies there um and who else is doing offers well everybody's at it so anyway every crafts a pound is the one I'm doing today so. Um, some of this stuff wasn't even a pound. Some of this stuff was, the cheapest item I got was 30p. So we'll wait and see what that was. Right, so first thing here is this washi tape. Um, now I do have this cupcake paper. I've had it for a while. It's not new by any means. But I've not had the bits to go with. I think I've got buttons to go with it, but nothing else. I'm just going to zoom in a little bit. Lost my zooming button. Um, yeah, so um, it's nice to have a little bit of washi tape to use with some of those papers. And likewise, I've got the um, blush washi tape as well to use. Um, these washi tapes, you have to bear with me because there's some big lists. There's, these were a pound each. That was nice then i've got these victoria and albert um washi tapes which i've also got papers to go with that will come up later i think they were a pound as well um yeah they were a pound for three and in there you get five meters on each roll and they're lovely look at those lovely designs kind of like vintagey really arty designs so they're going to be nice to use on a card. I've got this Be Happy um, three five metre rolls for a pound. Um, look at those, gorgeous. In fact, the honeycomb, the gold honeycomb, uh, the Be Happy tape, and then the sort of foliage one. A pound. I got some Wiz Kids bits and bobs. So I've got some Wiz Kids buttons. Now, the Wiz Kids range is has been on offer for quite some time and I've not really bought it, but I thought, do you know what? I've had so many kids' things come up lately that I thought I'm going to buy it um, at last and it is just all so cheap. Um, so I'm glad that I've finally got around to it. These were 50p. And look, there's so many different buttons. There's like flower ones, square ones, the see-through ones. So cute. So definitely 50p, you can't go wrong, can you? I got myself a couple of pairs of scissors. I got these antibacterial microban six-inch soft grip scissors from Westcott. They feel really comfy. They're cold, <laughs> very cold. Um, and they were a pound. I mean, a pound for a pair of scissors is just a bargain anyway especially for a good brand and then I got the small scissors as well um, the Westcott pink scissors which are four inches and they're really they're going to be handy for when I'm doing that fussy cutting and stuff I don't want to use my tiny embroidery scissors but I don't want to use big ones either so they kind of complement my existing sort of this type of size scissor I've got a bit of a thing for scissors, if I'm honest. Then I also got these sweet moments. I've got the Wiz Kids gems. The Wiz Kids gems were 50p. Um, I thought they'll go nice with the Wiz Kids range of stuff. 
and the Sweet Moments Adhesive Curls. They'll go nice with this um, washi tape and the paper that I already have to go with that. I don't know if I've even bought more paper, but um, yeah, definitely going to be lovely for um, a recipe memory book that I'm going to be making. Um, well, a recipe journal. And they were, <laughs> yeah, they were a pound <laughs> after all that. So they're nice to go in that sort of set. Then something else I bought was these A7 mini cards and envelopes. You get 20 in the pack and you get the cards, obviously, and the envelopes. I just thought these would be really nice to use as little thank you cards because I'm never prepared never ever prepared for anything and I thought that'd be nice really nice just to make up and use this little thank you card for great quality and these these were 50p I mean 50p for 20 cards and 20 envelopes you can't go wrong you really can't in the whiskey's range I also got the the little boy playing football stamp and that was 50p um in the back to basics the dovecraft to go with this sort of range i got these ribbons and um they were a pound and there's a meter of each of the five colors and these will go great with stamping up stuff as well the colors are really nice to get to match up with stamping up things um as well then I got the Be Happy little stamp set. I just love this fern and I love these flowers here. And don't worry, Be Happy. I just thought it's a really lovely thing. Lovely stamp. So they go together with that. I was too late to get the paper. Um, I think Steph on FEN card, she hauled from, um, a, did a mini haul from Every Craft of the Pan and she got the paper. I missed out on the paper, unfortunately. Then I've got this little stamp, which I just loved. It's like a really, I thought I could make a really lovely vintage looking card with that. It's got um, perfume bottles, like vintage perfume bottles on it. Um, and that was, I think that was, it might have only been 50p. It might have been a pound. Oh, that was 50p. That, and you've got that um, perfume set and then you've got the little flower there as well. Thought that was really cute and I thought that might go nicely with some of these vintage B and A papers. Then I got the sweet moments um stamps and dies which are really cute the cake all these are becoming um have come the, this is an old set that I've had I mean the papers and stuff I've had about two or three years but there I mean I have bought more papers I know I have just remembered um but they've they've all this sort of tea theme has come back. I think it's because tea's become so popular as a drink again, and um, so people are are getting a bit more into tea on the cards again. Um, but this was oh, that was a pound, so a pound for the dies and the stamps is fabulous and they're lovely so i can't wait to use those they can go in with them, the sweet moments bits and bobs then i'll save those because they're quite something then i got the sweet moments um eight by eight paper pack this was i think this was a pound Yeah, this was a pound and this is 8 by 8 papers. You get 36 sheets, 3 sheets of 12 designs, 150 GSM, acid and lignin free or lignin free or whatever it's, however you say it. My dogs have come to join me so you can hear them tapping around in the background. Hopefully they won't start barking. I'm just going to go through this real quick. Some really lovely designs it's really nice quality i've used this before um lovely papers 
and a single sided which pleases me because I don't have to then make a choice between uh, my two children as I call it but look these are all tea themed tea roses little macarons just gorgeous little background oh lovely gingham there lovely stripey one so there's some lovely patterns there for me to use and all these bits go with that as well that's the back to basics and this is the sweet moments so that's that then i've got another whiz kids um another whiz kids stamp here i've got the little birthday girl and the happy birthday the little flowers here the little bunting I mean, with this one, you get a little bee flying about. You get a star, so cool. The little dog balancing the ball. So even if it's not the kids you're after, the other stamps that come with them are great. There's the pirate. It's your birthday. I mean, that's just going to be a clear stamp. The cat. And it's just they're just so cute. And they were they're only fifty p, fifty p each. Um. Yeah, 50p. Then I've got these DNA flowers. Look at these. These are just beautiful. Um, so they'll go with those DNA washi tapes. And I should have some papers as well. But these are absolutely gorgeous fabric flowers. In the same designs as the paper. And to complement them. I'm going to be able to make some really lovely stuff with those. Stick some nice gems in the centre of them as well. Absolutely beautiful. Love that there's different shapes, pointed ones and rounded ones. Be able to layer some of those up as well. Absolutely gorgeous. And they were um, a pound for those. They go with the VA stuff. And then um, I've got some more with kids bits. There's a ballerina, and like I said, it's 50p for all of these stamps on here. You can't go wrong. Some more back to basics ribbon. I've got two packs of this one, um, the purple one. Um, this is going to have been a pound, yeah berry blush ribbon pack um, so that's the back to basics there and put that over there and then the WizKids pegs were 20p again you can't go wrong the pack for 20p and then we're coming into some papers now but before that I'll just pull these out Need some papers now. So then I got these gorgeous buttons, the sweet these little wooden wooden buttons. buttons that have been painted. They're gorgeous. Then I got these little bees, gold bees to go with the Be Happy set. They're gorgeous little embellishments. Got this little die, little bottle of champagne in a glass. Thought that would be nice to use on wedding cards. It's coming up to, well, it's not coming up to, but we're starting to think about wedding season. I've got already, two sets we? of these, um, and these are interchangeable clear stamps. Um, I just thought they were gorgeous. This set has got, let me just find out how much these were. Um, they're going to have been a pound, aren't they? Oh, no, they were 50p. So these sets were 50p each. The Habico large border stamps. Um, and there's just so many stamps in each one. And they're just lovely. You've got the border there. You've got the heart. The heart in the middle. The lovely vase with flowers. You've got the little flowers around. And then you've got these edging stamps. Absolutely beautiful. Hearts. Little flowers. Dots. Um, just abstract designs. Um, you've got some sentiments. Best wishes. Good luck. A little bow, a little clover for you, a little swirly flourish um, from and to, little flowers here. So that's 
brilliant for what for 50p you can't go wrong can you um and then the other one has this circle and a flower has a bigger flourish different sort of style um edges best wishes stamp have a nice day dear friend miss you a lovely little swell i don't think i've got a miss you stamp um yeah so they're gorgeous for a quid one pound only then <laughs> I got the WizKids 6x6 paper to go with uh, that because I'm going to be doing that because I'm going to do an album of that. Um, and the WizKids paper was 75p. 75p for 6x6. It's um, 45 sheets. Four sheets of, sorry, 48 sheets, four sheets of 12 designs, 150 GSM and acid free. So, oh, it's not only that, but it's also embossed. It's glittery, sort of embossed. Absolutely gorgeous. Really nice quality paper that. And this is... Look at these gorgeous papers. I mean, you can use them for anything. The, that's gorgeous, like hessian. It's not just a smooth finish. Um, some of them are, but some of them are a bit more than that. Absolutely gorgeous stuff for 75 pence. So, of course, I've really pushed the boat out and I've got two of those. Um go with that and even if you don't use them with the rest of the WizKids range there's still gorgeous papers at bargain price then I got these oh there's the other one there of the WizKids paper packs both the same oops then I got these back to basics six by six cards and envelopes. This is a 12 pack, um, so you've got 12 cards and 12 envelopes. They were a pound. So I've got the, the bright spark, which are the pink and the blue, and I've got the berry burst, which are the purples and pinks. So that's gorgeous. And then I got. Another set of those. Oh yeah, I've got another set. The Back to Basics Blue Skies um, cards and envelopes. I just thought, even if you don't use them, so that'll go with that. Even if you don't use them as cards, you know, as you use them just as mats and layers and stuff and things to cut die cuts out of, they're just an absolute bargain. Um, like I said, um... For a pound for 12 you can't go wrong and then i got these which are the v and a 12 cards and envelopes these are 140 240 gsm and 100 gsm envelope which is quite generous for an envelope and these are a pound these are five by sevens And they were just a pound. Lovely quality, that. Okay, and again, even if you just use it as card, both sides of the colour. And they're the, those gorgeous sort of neutral, blushy shades that are going to go really well with the other bits in that um, collection. Then I got something called Back to Basics Goodie Bags. I got pink and I got monochrome and I got purple. So I got these Back to Basics packs um, from Dovecraft. I got a monochrome, oops, 
I got the purple and I got the pink. And would you believe that these cost me £5 and that was for all three of them. So you get three for £5. They come in these zipped up uh, bags which is sealed which is handy because then you know nobody's pinched anything out of it. Um, and are great for storage as well, these Ziploc bags. Oops, got a little, another little one through it. And then inside, you get a ton of goodies. It says what each one contains. Contains 8x8 craft papers, 8 designs by 2 sheets. So you get 16 sheets, 6x6 six six craft papers, 4 designs by 2 sheets. A pack of eight sentiment toppers, 15 paper blossoms, 91 gems, 60 buttons, six by six cards and envelopes, three colours, two of each colour, and a project sheet. Now, that is a great gift for somebody who wants to try their hand at card making. Look at that. It's, it's just. What more could you wish for? And there's the project sheet. So let's have a little look at the project sheet. And like I said, each one of these has all of this stuff inside of it. So you've got these lovely papers. This is a monochrome. This is all black and white, obviously. So you've got those nice little designs. Gorgeous designs. The butterflies. Little Position markers, plates, florals, grid paper, mini florals, zigzags. And then you've got your project sheet and it tells you what you need. Uh, it's got everything you need except little some double-sided tape, some glue and some foam squares. So your adhesives are what you need to add. But if you're doing a class or something, um, this is great. Um, and it tells you exactly what size square to cut and everything to get your card gives you a card you can make there on that project sheet these are the cards so you get black grey and the sort of off-white um, and then lovely quality nice big cards and again even if you just wanted to use the card for something else it's fabulous value these are, you know so you're looking at these being one pound about £1.60 each for the whole kit and you're getting those lovely sentiments there that look like they're on leather and then there's the gems I mean you pay £1.60 for the gems the flowers and the buttons in every kit so it's just absolutely fabulous value great to give people as a gift which is um, one of the reasons we've got some them. more of these Back to Basics little flowers um, which were a pound perfect pink blossoms which will go on anything really um, then I've got some V&A some more V&A stuff these little photo frames that are going to go great in um, an album and the V&A photo frames were a pound then I've got the V&A stamp set, which is um, really lovely. It's got thank you with a little bird. It's got happy birthday with a really beautiful sort of monastic decorated H. Um, with love, special wishes, congratulations just for you and thinking of you. Um, I've got the painted blooms. Stamps were a pound. They were a pound as well. Lovely flowers. Stem. Life is sweet and happy birthday really love those and then I've got some cute little dies got a little cat a little star a little flower and a little dog and I got obviously earlier on I showed you the little um, the little champagne bottle they're from Simply Creative and they're all a pound as well okay and I've got the Simply Creative paper pack as well this is the enchantment paper pack and this is six by six um 30 sheets 15 designs two of each 120 gsm and it's acid free oh look how cute 
I'm just going to flick through because I'm not going to open it up. Little diamonds on there, clouds, flowers, beautiful papers in there. The sausage dogs, dashings, just swirls and butterflies and lovely stuff. Um, so that's going to go really nice with the um, little dies there. Then we're on to big papers. Yeah. So everything else is a 12 by 12. So the first one is this Make a Wish. And this was £1 for a 12 by 12 paper stack, 36 sheets. Um, I'm going to open it up. You can always fold it if you don't want to go through all the sheets. But sometimes it's nice to see what's inside because you can't always tell from an image on the screen. So you've got this happy time to celebrate. That's that's nice paper. That's a plain on the back. That's a nice paper for um, a birthday. But it's nice for a New Year's Eve card or something as well. Um. We've got a nice sort of mustardy coloured one there. That would be nice for the crushed curry ink and crushed curry things from stamping up. You've got the confetti, lovely sort of stripy one, party hats, balloons. The balloons are on grid paper as well, that's quite nice. And cakes, all sorts of different ones. There's gift boxes. And then there's like just sort of like a watercolory, wishy washy. There's ice cream, sundaes, some gorgeous stuff in there. I'm going to be using some of that today actually. I've got a project I need that for. Two of those for a pound each, you can't go wrong. I've got these sweet moments um, as well. This was a pound. Um, so I've got two of those. They are gorgeous. You've got cakes and flowers and cups of tea and roses. Really gorgeous. The gingham. So I've got those. And then finally, I've got the two V&A. Um, I've got two V&A 12 by 12 pads as well. And I'm going to show you these because they're just gorgeous. If you, I mean, I think we all kind of like different types of things, don't we? Um, you know, I love sometimes it depends what you're making and who it's for and what mood you're in and everything else. But I do love real nice sort of heritage designs, and that's what this is supposed to be. These are full designs adapted from original textiles in the Victorian Albert Museum's collection, and that's 150 grams. You get 36 sheets, three sheets of 12 designs and they're acid and whatever free. Look at that. It's like fabric. It's absolutely gorgeous. I mean, I'm not joking. You'd need to feel that to really appreciate how lovely it is. It's beautiful. Single-sided so you're not wasting anything on the back. Absolutely gorgeous. You've got lovely, you know, to go nice, really nice with navy, go nice with the tranquil tide if you've got stamping up inks and papers. Just beautiful. Look at that as a real sort of vintage Tudor y look, isn't it? Gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Nice and dainty as well. And then you've got these big bold pattern in that kind of. Um, Wedgwood blue, it's really lovely, and then this one, absolutely lovely. Then you've got this one that's like an oriental inspired design. I suppose a lot of fabrics were coming from, uh, you know, on the spice route. This is like um, it looks like it's got a hessian. It's absolutely gorgeous. Gorgeous colour. Look at 
this one for vibrant colour. That'd be great even to cut it into strips to use down the side of cards and things. Oh gosh, that's a lovely one. You can make some really nice little interior decor pieces, those little boxes to stash things in out of this. Look at that. Stunning stuff. So, yeah, and that's the one. Remember the washi tape. There's one of those as well. So, yeah, that's going to make a really gorgeous little photo album. So, oh, look at that one. Missed that one out. That's really dainty and pretty. Just full of colour and and depth. Absolutely gorgeous. So I've got two of those because they were just a pound as well. So that was one massive haul and um, the whole thing cost me 50 quid. Right, so for now I'm going to call it a day and get on with actually using some of it. First of all I need to sort my craft space out because it's an absolute I saw <laughs> so yeah I need to get on with sorting out first before I do anything else so I'll see you very soon thank you for joining me and take care bye bye